Hi, welcome to my channel and today I have another theatre vlog for you. So today I'm going to be heading to the Lowry to see Fantastic Great Women That Changed the World. Um, it's based on the book by Kate, pa Kate Pankhurst and it's um, been produced by the producers of Six. It's supposed to be really good. Um, I think it's based more towards children because the book is a children's book but I've heard lots of adults say really good things about it so I thought I would give it a try um, because there was an offer on for £15 ticket so I only paid £15 for my ticket. It's in the smaller theatre at the Lowry um, if you don't know the Lowry theatre it has a big theatre called the Lyric Theatre and it has a small theatre called the Keys Theatre and this production is in the Keys Theatre so I don't think I've ever been in the Keys Theatre, I'm not quite sure I might have been quite a long time ago I'll obviously realise once I get there um, but yeah I'm really looking forward to it, it should be good the only thing is my daughter is ill today so I wasn't sure if I was even going to go um, but she just seems very very tired and she's just sleeping so my parents are going to come and sit with her at our house so she can just sleep So, and it's only a short show it's only an hour and 20 minutes long I'm not sure if there's an interval as well I'm not sure, I'll find out when I get there but I'll obviously show you around the theatre when I get there, show you any merch I won't be going out to get lunch today I'm just going straight to the theatre and straight back so um, if there's any merch I'll show you hopefully there's a programme that I can get as well and obviously when I get back I'll tell you what I think of it, also I know that with this musical you are allowed to film the mega mix at the end and the curtain call so I'll be able to film that for you as well. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. So I will get back to you now once I'm on my way to the theatre. And actually my dad is taking me, so I won't be getting a tram or anything. My dad's going to drop me off and pick me up. So yeah, I'll get back to you now once I'm on my way. Miz might be on as well actually in the bigger theatre and that's what I'm looking so busy so I'm gonna head in now and obviously I'll show you around once I get in there Lame is on in the bigger theatre, okay. so I just need to go to the smaller theatre, which should be around here.
really for Texas of you. It's amazing. I'm just gonna see if I can find a private one. today because my children are both fast asleep on the sofa 
Um, they both, I think they both might be a bit ill, so they're both fast asleep. So I'm going to have to film in here um, and tell you what I thought of the show. Um, it is a fast, fantastic great women who changed the world. Saw it obviously at the Lowry in Salford. It was in the Keys Theatre, the smaller theatre. I paid £15 for my ticket and I was sat in the stalls tier, um, row A, seat 21. I was supposed to be in seat 21 but the woman that was in um, the seat ne next to mine, I think it was, she asked if I could move so she could sit next to her granddaughter because they seemed to have booked these two seats next to each other and then one seat on its own and I think I was in the far one and then her granddaughter was there and she was there. So she asked if I didn't mind swapping so her and her granddaughter could sit together so I didn't mind swapping because I prefer to sit on my own. It's more space so I just swapped with her so I'm not sure what seat that would have been. Um, I'll have to have a look um, and see and I'll put it in the description so you know exactly what seat it was but it was a great view. The view was really really good. I really thought I had a great view of the show so definitely a good seat to sit in if you're in that theatre. Um, and I only paid £15 for the ticket because there was an offer on, on manchestertheatres.com um, they often have offers on for theatre shows and the offer for this one was £15 for any available seat um, I think usually they're £30 so it was a good offer like half price and yeah I really enjoyed the show I know like I said it's aimed at I think children um, 8 and up I think um, but I really really enjoyed it I thought it was really good there's other adults there that really really enjoyed it as well obviously it's based on the book which was written by Kate Kate Pankhurst um, and yeah I really really enjoyed it so if you don't know anything about the musical it is a new musical I think it's like it's world it's its world premiere tour um, so it's tour in the UK it's the first time it's toured anywhere UK is the first time it's on tour it's a pop musical it's like the songs in it are very poppy um, uh, obviously to get kids to enjoy it I was like, like it's based for kids so the songs are very poppy and they're very catchy like I said it's by the producers of Six so it's very similar I found it very similar to those songs the musical is about a girl called Jade she gets separated from her class at a museum and she um, ends up going into an exhibit which isn't open yet and then along her journey she meets um, obviously these fantastic women from from history these mommy's little man little man oh. so my little boy has come to join me yeah so she meets these fantastic women throughout history she learns about their journeys and what they've achieved and yeah it's just a really fun uplifting show and yeah definitely recommend it so it tells you a bit of, of the story of a few women obviously throughout history um, Amelia Earhart, Sacagawea, Frida Kahlo, uh, Marie Curie, um, Rosa Parks, Mary Seacole, um, Emmeline Pankhurst, Gertrude Eddeley, Jane Austen, Mary Anning, so yeah a lot of like really influential women throughout history and it was really really good that it's produced by the same people that made Six so the music I thought sounded very similar to some of Six songs and um, really funny I really enjoyed it it was very very funny and yeah all the kids seem to be really enjoying themselves as well so I definitely recommend it I, I really really enjoyed it so the only thing I bought from the show was this program I think this was five pounds they were selling a few other bits they had the book they had some pencils they had pin badges um i think that was it um i did film it so you will have seen it in the in the video but yeah i really enjoyed it i thought the sets was good obviously it's a touring production uh it was a really simple set but i thought the set really worked for the show it was really really good and I just thought the cast were amazing the cast was so good um, the cast definitely made it I just thought the women that were playing all the characters played them so well and so uh, I just really really enjoyed it I definitely recommend it um, it's on tour currently so it's on at Salford um, till the 9th of April till, till this Saturday 
and then it's heading to um, the Kingston Rose Theatre. I'm not sure where that is. That's the next one on the list. Um, so if you see on the back of the programme, it lists all the places that it's going to. So I will link below the website for the show, which will list you all the places that it's heading to. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd show you a bit of the programme. So at the front, you've got an advertisement for the books. Uh, then you've got a note from Kate Pankhurst, so her writing about how she came to write the books and everything, um, about bringing about bringing the musical to life. You've got some um, paintings of the characters. You've got some production photos. You've got a Q and A with Mar with Miranda Cooper. It's also got some information on some women that are currently changing the world. And then this page tells you all the um, fantastically great women that are in the show. So I think I already said the names of most of them. So you've got Amelia Earhart, you've got a little bit of information about her. Sacagawea, some information about her. Emmeline Pankhurst. Go to Edley and yeah, all the other ones that were in it. And there, it's a bit of information about each of them. And then you have the amazing cast. They were they were just so good. I just really enjoyed the performance of all of them. They were so funny. The singing was amazing. I just really enjoyed the cast. I thought they were so good. So playing Jade is Kazea Magombi. I think that's how you pronounce the name, sorry if it's wrong, but let me get a come forward. So yeah, she played Jade, she's like the main character, the girl who's um meeting all these characters. And you've got Jade Kennedy. So she played Sacagawea, Frida Cahill, Mary Curie, and Miss Morris, which is one of the teachers. And then we have Rini Lamb. She played Amelia Earhart, Rosa Parks, Mary Seacole, and Miss Ashley. And that was what well, Miss Ashley is a teacher. Then we have Christina Modesto. I think that's how you pronounce the name. She played Gertrude Edderley, Jane Austen, Mary Anning, and Miss Richards, one of the teachers. And you have Kirsty Scaventon. She played Amelia Pankhurst, Agent Fifi and Miss Johnson, and then you have Clarice Juliander, and she was the swing. And then you also have Elise Zavu, and she was the swing. So that was the amazing cast, and then the rest of the programme in here, you've got your cast list, your musicians, your production team, creative team, and there. And then this is a bit about the musicians. And then like choreographer and all the other behind the scenes people, the producers. And then it's got this little bit for you to draw. Draw the people you admire in this frame. Obviously for the kids. And then how are you going to change the world? You're such great women in this book, never gave up. Write your own hopes and dreams on this page. Something for the kids. And that is it, and then it's just got an advert for a new musical, which is going to Larry in August, I think. Identical, based on the parent trap, which I really want to say, it looks really good. So, yeah, that is the programme from the show. And so, yeah, I hope you have enjoyed this little theatre vlog. It's probably not as long as my usual theatre vlog. Like I said, I just went straight to the theatre, got dropped off, got picked up. Didn't have to travel, didn't get any lunch or anything while I was out. Um, so, yeah, it's probably not as long as my other vlogs. Uh, but hopefully you still enjoyed it and it was such a good show. Like I said, don't be put off because it's supposed to be based for children. I'm 38 years old and I really enjoyed it. I would go and see that again. I thought it was really good. So, yeah, if it's coming to a by value, do go and see it. There was other people there without children. I wasn't the only one. There was quite a few adults there as well enjoying the show. So, yeah, definitely go and see it if it's coming to a theatre near you. And if you have children, I'd say maybe seven, eight years old up, 
they will absolutely love it. So yeah, if you do enjoy theatre vlogs, I am going to see a few more shows uh, in a couple of weeks. Uh, next week I'm actually going to go and see Six in Liverpool. Um, then the week after that I'm seeing Adam's family and I'm also seeing Les Mis. So if you're interested in seeing vlogs for any of those shows, please do subscribe and hit the notification bell and you'll be notified as soon as those vlogs go up. So yeah, like I said, I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please do give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe and hope to see you again soon. Bye.